Go. I've engineered a um, burlap spring deck, which is not typical to this historic upholstery. The original burlap was simply pulled over the top of the springs, tacked down to the side rails, no interior infrastructure that like what we've set in to, to protect the piece. And it created gullies and divots and dimples along the way and allowed the stuffing to just drop down into troughs. This made the piece very uncomfortable and it also helped lead to, to failure of the mattress cloth. So we're trying to mitigate those problems by, by the creation of a basic foundation that will not allow the springs to drop in the way they had originally dropped. As you can see, I'm going to just fold this out before we get close-ups. You can see that the body of the deck is boxed. Or the, the body is plain with a boxing that surrounds it. So it's picture framed with a stretcher that's sewn down the middle that okay. corresponds with this is a stretcher corresponds with the flex point of the frame. So the whole idea is to make certain that, that as this piece flexes, the burlap foundation doesn't begin to luft or dimple or crawl, because that is, then is the basis for failure of the final covering. So we want to make sure that this stays in, in proper position. Ultimately, all around this boxing, the springs will be lashed to the burlap where the burlap cannot move and uh, the burlap will be tacked down into a trough which will be filled with um, uh, fiber stuffings.